The Seattle Seahawks and the New York Jets will both be facing questions at the quarterback position when they face off in the Meadowlands this Sunday. Russell Wilson suffered a sprained MCL in Week 3, but is expected to start against the Jets. And as a result, Seattle opened this matchup as 2.5 point road fades. This despite traveling west-east for an early Sunday kickoff. Wilson was already nursing an ankle injury, and being hobbled has clearly affected his game. Last season, Wilson attempted 6.4 rushes for 34.6 yards per game, while this year he is attempting just 3.3 rushes for a total of 11 yards per game. The QB questions on the other side of the ball are much more performance-based. Ryan Fitzpatrick is coming off just a horrendous game against the Chiefs, throwing for zero touchdowns and six, count them, six interceptions. In fact, at one point, he threw an INT on five consecutive drives. Fitzpatrick is now the owner of the NFL's worst QB rating at 59.3. To make matters worse for the Jets, wide receiver Eric Decker aggravated a shoulder injury and his status for Sunday is uncertain. Darrell Rivas and Matt Forte both also are listed as questionable. There are more injuries on the Seahawks side of the ball as well. Running back Thomas Rawls is out a few weeks with a fibula injury, prompting the team to sign free agent running back CJ Spiller. If there's one thing these teams still have going for them, it's defense. Seattle ranks first in total defense this season, while the Jets rank third in rush defense. So expect some tough sledding as these two banged up teams combine to give up just 159.4 rush yards per game. For all the latest betting analysis, odds, and hot trends, make sure to follow us on Twitter, at Covers.